Welcome to Collective Sales Scorecard Dashboard. This report is useful for anybody who is looking to do sales analytics, especially people who are selling products. First, the revenue overview displays what our revenue was and how many stores helped to get there, what percent of the sales goal was reached, notated by a gauge scale, and finally, how these numbers compared to the last year with a KPI indicator. Next, the user is able to see some of the top store's sales and profit margin. In addition to being able to break out by category, the user is able to click to open a filter pane to make selections based on country, city, and year. Once these selections have been made, some users may find difficulty with these numbers not matching what they think. This is usually due to a filter still being applied, so the user has the ability to revert to the original by clicking on this button right here. Next up is the revenue breakdown. Here, the user is able to see a geographical view of revenue generation, as well as KPIs off to the side that notate sales, profit margin, number of stores, average bottle price, and average bottle cost. The user is able to overlay this with existing population density information to make a comparison. It also displays demographic and income information. Moving from the map to a decomposing tree view, here users can see the total sales, and then break that down into category, vendor name, and item description. Built into our sales scorecard, the user has the ability to ask the data a question. Simply navigate to the left pane and choose a question. For example, what is the sales difference by store city? And it then has the ability to show what that difference is, in addition to top store countries by sale last year, and following key influencers in the average of sales by category. The user also has the ability to only show values that are influencers. This is a brief overview of Collective Sales Scorecard Dashboard. Please contact us for more details at gocollective.com.